Hi guys, this is Quant Namat. Welcome to my channel. In this episode of uh, Do Not Trade It, we'll take a look at another very popular fake trade new strategy. So this strategy is open close cross strategy by Jay Rogers. And the strategy is very, very popular. You have here 6,000 likes, 48,000 views. And um, if you look at the performance, of course, it looks really great, you know, 84% profitable trades, a pretty good net drop down and a very small max drop down. And, you know, we have really nice and smooth equity line. So it looks really, really good. But is it does it work or not? Let's try to investigate. So let's go to um, Bin Editor. So here I have Bitcoin USD pair on our chart. And here I copied already um, this function. So now let's add it to, to the chart and let's look how the strategy works and as you can see it works amazingly we have 288 percent net profit with almost zero percent max drop down uh, 94 percent profitable trades with you know profit factor of 80. it's just unbelievably good and now let's try to understand what's going on why it, it doesn't work this way so if you go to um, entries, we can see we use this long condition in entry. And this long condition is basically crossover of closed series and open series and vice versa for short condition. If we look for how close series is calculated, you can see it here. Basically, you can see it in simple uh, way. You can see that it's calculated as this res function call. And um, here it is. This is the res function. It seems like we we calling security function and get data from uh, higher resolution for um, for for uh, for the same ticker. So basically, here in in uh, in uh, inputs we have like two hour resolution for uh, this start res variable, and here I have one hour chart. So basically, in this function we kind of look into the future, get open price. Uh, kind of this bar open price get closing price from the future we compare them and this way we uh, enter the trades and of course trades are good if you know the, if you kind of know the future if you use this block of version 2 of pine script i have special video about it you can uh, take it take a look at it so let's um as, as a quick uh, kind of uh it's a quick check we can just change version to version three and we can take a look uh, how it works after that so let's edit the chart yeah, it seems like we need to add something here so this is self-reference variables in version three uh, you need to define it first um, it should be false and here we will um, assign it so this should work So as you can see, performance dropped a bit, but it's still very, very good. You know, we have like 86% profit, almost zero max drawdown as well. It's not like so perfect, but it's still very good 80% profitable trades. So it's like this, this is real performance. Um, well, if we go and dig deeper, we can find uh, this stuff. So this is basically implementation of uh, trading you kind of trailing um, stop loss. So here is how it uh, called. So basically you have two variables, um, tra trailing po points and trail offset. Uh, so tra trailing points is um, you wait for this amount of points before you activate your stop loss. Um, so if you, you really long position, you want um, position to grow this kind of um, number of points and after that you offset certain amount of stop loss and you kind of wait when it will hit it and um, problem is that in trading you uh, this stuff works not very good so it's not realistic so uh, let me show you how it works so you can see that this is a performance if i just go to the strategy and we'll just uh, click not to use trail stop loss you can see it just become awful let's edit again if you look at how it works actually so basically you can see that very often we enter a trade and we exit the same uh, kind of uh, the same bar 
a bit lower and we can have some profits from that and it's it's a bit weird so here we can see we have long we exit here and it's, uh, it's it seems really nice and good but it's not actual how it works problem is that in trading you have a very simple definition of uh, open high low close bars so for example if i use one hour chart uh, during back testing uh, trading you doesn't know kind of how my price behave you can kind of fluctuate between open high low close quite a lot but here we don't have it so basically trading you for um, um, for green bars it thinks that it starts at open go to a uh, low then go to high and then go to close and that's it and um, to check that actually this makes so big difference let's go to another um, uh, trading new script, uh, script and here you can see um, very simple primitive script so what I do is simply so for the last two months I just every bar for one hour chart I go long and after that I create a trailing stop exit and I use the same uh, trail prop points and trail offset as in uh, previous script I showed you now let's add this to chart and you can see that this primitive script is just amazingly good we have 50% net profit with 0% max drop down so it's just amazingly good and of course it's not realistic so because of this very strange uh, very simplistic way of uh, kind of uh, running back test on just open op only on this four to four, four values open high low close we have this kind of back that will actually show you very nice performance but it's not actually real if you need to know a bit more about this back you can go to uh, this website I'll leave a um, link to this website in uh, video description and this guy actually goes in details through this back and you can understand how this stuff works better and why it's not realistic so um, about the strategy it's um, it's fake for sure uh, performance you can see here it's unreachable it's unrealistic it's repaints and it has like this stop uh, trailing stop loss back as well so please don't trade it so i think that's all for this video thank you for watching bye